Hey Virgo, this is Ascension Empress with your love reading, your, I think it's your general love, your monthly love or your mid-month love, I don't know, we'll see. <laughs> um, but thank you all so much for all your support, your patience, booking with me. I am open for personals um, this month, so you can check below for the information. Please email me first and don't just send your money. Um, and be mindful, if there are like other readers out there or just other channels who have merchandise um or who do personals make sure you go to their page and click on their links because there are people out there who are you know selling other other products and you know getting trying to get money out of other people so please be mindful um but yes this is for my virgo sun moon and rising may peace and blessings be upon everyone welcome if you are new and i thank you all so much please like share and subscribe we're gonna get right into it and see what messages we have in love for you all I'll be using the Right Away Tarot deck, and I may clarify with the Talima, the Mother piece. And we do have some new decks coming up, so I'll be using those for your mid months. And y'all just let me know um, what y'all want going forward because the love readings have been highly requested again. So let me know what resonates with you um, and any feedback. But yes, may peace and blessings be upon you all. Let's see, what messages do we have for my Virgos and love for the month of February? What messages do we have? Wow, you have the Eight of Pentacles. So some of y'all may be working on something right now, working on building together, um, investing, whatever it is you have in investing all your time and energy into, you're doing it again. Um, and this time, I, I keep hearing precision, precision. So this could be a skill. You could be focused on your own pinnacle right now on your own craft your gift so let's see what messages do we have going into the past wow look at that baby okay <laughs> yes you have the empress and the ace of pinnacles so first of all there's a lot of messages <laughs> one i get that there could be a mother figure that provided you some type of security or some type of opportunity um for you to put in this extra work yeah it's like supporting you in a gift and a hobby that you have um i'm also getting this is you you this is you very abundant very creative um really in your root yeah but especially with this look at that you see that red at the bottom of the chairs like very rooted very grounded and secure um, also in your femininity while being able to create a pentacle is what I'm getting. Um, so let's see what messages do we have going forward. Um, somebody also sees you as a very, they like, they, this is an opportunity they cannot miss. You know, like, uh, hello, this is a gift from the heavens is what I'm seeing with the Ace of Pentacles. Like you are a gift to, you know, they're like, oh, let's, let's work on this. Let's, let's work on this. Let's build together. So let's see what messages do we have going to the future. Look at that. <laughs> oh, that's why I was laughing. I was like, what is this energy coming through? You got the Knight of Swords. So some of y'all could be dealing with, uh, it could come through as a message, an email, a text message. But I, I get it real air-like energy and it could have its Mercury retrograde. Have them, you know, coming in while you are focused, consistent, diligent with your time, your energy. And someone is um, probably coming in indirectly, but directly with this air-like energy. Uh, Aquarius, Gemini, or Leo. Libra. and they uh, we'll see <laughs> yeah I just seen the eight of wands so let's see what is the underlying messages that we have for Virgo and love what is this look you got the world card somebody wants to start a new chapter um you also in your own world you are protecting your energy is what I'm getting the, because you know as an empress you know when to go with the flow when to sew yeah and this is the the page is turning for you that's why you're at eight pinnacles um so there could be some type of distraction interference coming in but <laughs> the way your head is down you might just look at you might look up real quick and laugh let's see look at that i know that wow yes 
what's at the bottom you got the queen of cups doing it with elegance okay so first of all you got the death card and the ace of wands and the five of pentacles so this may be somebody who's feeling left out of course um but also you being in this energy i'm getting the the reason that you're able to be in this eight of pentacles tunnel vision energy why you transform all you got all the energy okay very attractive as well is because you've been here you know you've been somebody may have left you feeling left out and and while they coming back from a distance because i'm i'm getting for many of you they can't come in physically um i get there's boundaries there's requirements there's like you got a whole schedule you got time your time is accounted for is what i'm getting there's been a transformation and look i mean this is you going into the past so like you priority some of y'all came into this new year like uh, uh you know this is what i'm manifesting this is what i want for myself and you got there's a huge transformation you shed the old use so let's see what message do we have for this um empress and ace of pentacles going into the past look at that baby some of y'all decided i want to be single okay i will take one less pinnacle you know, if I and I, I'm gonna make it work. Look at that. I'm gonna make it work. One less pinnacle, baby. Okay, so let's see. Clarify the Knight of Swords. I told myself, you know, we're not gonna do too long of the love readings um, until, you know, people give me feedback. But this is so straightforward, y'all. Knight of Swords. Wow. What did I say? This person, like, someone feels intimidated by how you. You give your time and your, your energy to others. Someone probably wants to reciprocate. <laughs> um, they're like, uh, can I have a little something, something? And then look, you got the Knight of Cups. All they have to offer is emotions. And I'm also getting um, false promises. Like they, they show up as the Knight of Cups and the Knight of Swords. And I bet you they down there too with the Five of Wands energy. So they got that. And ooh, somebody probably have a gambling problem, an addiction problem. And they're coming in. They see you as a very very stable lucrative person in energy like you got the nine of pentacles the ace of pentacles and the empress going into the past and then you're still at it you're still creating i'm getting additional streams and so you are going to come across people with a lack mentality or who don't know how to manage you know so clarify the world card please look at that look at that oh my gosh i'm like i see the high priestess then look behind you got the the seven of swords coming from this energy you know they dwell in this when they're not around you they come with this and you know they, I, and it's an opportunist but spirit is here like hold up you know and, and spirit is with you that's why you know you're running right into someone who is transforming so now i'm talking to a cross watcher okay <laughs> you're running right into someone who is transforming some someone who god is positioning which is very clear someone who is aware of it with the, with the eight of pentacles so let's go ahead and clarify with the telema what advice we have for this eight of pentacles energy for my virgos look at that babe I look look at it look at it soak it in the high priestess and the nine of pentacles we done y'all we done take it how it resonates with you okay that's all I got to say. This is all I have to say. Look at that. I love you all. Thank you all so much. If you would like a personal reading, please email me. My information is down below. And please use your discernment, especially around this time of the retrograde. Please take care. Bye.